All right. Hey everybody. So today I want to do a small video um, about the nicotine levels and the different tiers that you can go through to work your way down and slowly wean off nicotine entirely and you know even wean off the e-cig if you want to. If you don't want to, you can do it at your own pace. It you know takes a year, it takes a month, it takes a week, whatever you want to do. But I'm also going to put on these sunglasses because I just think it makes me look that much cooler when I smoke my e-cig. What do you guys think? Give me some comments and let me know. So, alright, anyways, there's six tiers. And, of course, the one I recommend if you're starting to make the switch from real cigarettes to the e-cig is definitely the extra super high, which is the strength of uh, 28 milligrams of nicotine. And then it goes from 28 to 22 to 18 to 14 to 8, and then, of course, down to zero. So it's very beneficial because it allows you to work your way through the nicotine levels and slowly regulate your levels until you get down to hopefully nothing. Um, but that's really all I had to say today. But I hope that um, you know it was informational and that can definitely, uh, you know, from what I've heard from some of uh, the satisfied customers that have chosen to make the switch to a healthier lifestyle, they definitely said that you know moving from the tier levels downward is definitely the best way to go as well as uh i definitely took some uh, i went to a store and did some uh, research of my own and saw that most of the e-cigs they sell in the stores only have uh you know like 11, 10 or 11 milligrams of nicotine um, but definitely they were all less than uh, 15 which i know for a fact that wouldn't help me because I tried it and you know I bought a disposable one I think I, I got a green smoke one which I definitely was not satisfied with at all because I found it way too rough um, stale taste and um, you know then I found the pro smoke and saw that they had different levels of nicotine and it allows you to work your way down and it again I found it really easy to quit so hopefully it'll work for you And as you can see, you know, it's six, seven, ten, eight weeks, I think it's eight weeks in, and here I am, haven't had a real cigarette in probably five weeks, and I'm doing phenomenal. I haven't had a problem with it. I can already feel my lungs, I can breathe in the morning, and I can actually, you know, really feel the air, and I tend to ramble a lot, and so when I start rambling... I always have to stop and take a breath, whether it's mid-sentence, mid-word sometimes, if it happens to be a long word. And I've already noticed that I can ramble on without having to take those breaths that are at inconvenient points in what I'm trying to say. So hopefully it can work for you. Let me know what you guys think and, you know, have a good one. Peace out.